everybody, the Microsoft press conference is over. Now we're at a post-conference briefing where they are giving us a closer look at one of the biggest announcements, a new smaller Xbox 360 console. So here it is, and we're going to unbox it here for you right now. This is shipping right now to retailers. You can see sleek new design. It's got built-in Wi-Fi, which is one of the big things everyone's been asking for for a long time. They're already starting to connect marketing, even though that will not be out until this fall. Inside here. Papers, papers. Got some uh, nice foam there. Looks expensive. Here it is. Notice this is much smaller than the last one. They've done away with kind of the curved, fully curved uh, rectangular design. It's got a little bit of an angle to it now. Now, let's take a closer look at this console here because there are a few new features. First of all, the power button is a touch button. You don't need to push it all the way in. Also, the same thing with the eject button. That's just a touch button. There's no actual real physical button to push. Uh, over and down here on the bottom is how you get into the hard drive itself. This is removable. You cannot use the hard drive from your past 360s if you have one. But there, right there, you have your 250 gigabyte internal hard drive. You've got uh, USB ports in the front, as well as a whole slew of ports there in the back. We've got HDMI, we've got the standard AV, there's a bunch of USB ports there, there's an Ethernet port just in case you don't want to use the built-in Wi-Fi. There is an optical outlet, and there's also a custom connect outlet in the back there. Told that if you have an older Xbox 360, you'll have to use a special adapter because the Connect has a special connector. There's the power supply. This is actually a little bit different than what you might be used to. It's got a little bit of a different power adapter there. It of course comes with a controller. Looks a lot like the one you would get with an Elite. It's got a black headset here. You guys all know what a headset looks like. I don't think we need to really go into too much detail there. And as far as cables go, we've got a composite cable. We do not come with component cables, and there's also no HDMI cable in here, so you are on your own as far as an HD connection goes. So the last thing to talk about this is the noise level. Everyone knows Xbox 360 is really loud. They've consolidated the two internal fans into just one, and the result is something that's much quieter. If you get really up close, you can kind of hear it. I'll put the mic up on it so you can get your own listen here. There you have it. A closer look at the new Xbox 360 250 gigabytes, what they're calling it. They're not calling it a slim, but it definitely is a slimmer console. For much more on Xbox 360 and video games at large, stay tuned to IGN.com.